Hello, welcome to my channel Lunar Computer College. If you did not subscribe this channel yet, please click here to subscribe and also click on the bell icon to get the notifications. Today we are going to tell you about how to create the student result sheet. And today we are going to tell you about uh, the advanced result sheets in how to create student result sheet. So first of all, we had to make a structure of the result sheet. So I'm going to zoom my sheet here and uh, put the heading on the A1 cell okay and just uh, move your cell pointer down and here you may use the different items here like uh, serial number name and the subject so subject one okay and if you need to have more subjects you may drag from here put the cursor pointer and you can drag here and you may find out subjects different subject here so total average grade and remarks so we have different categories here if the serial number is one and there is a name you want to type any name of the student here suppose i'm just typing the abc suppose abc is the name and uh, i'm putting the subjects uh, obtaining marks here okay this is the subject obtaining marks here we are putting here subject obtaining marks but remember we are going to make the result sheet of those students who are gaining the numbers under 100 it means that each subject has the out 100 marks and the students are gaining out of 100 marks so what will be the formula of uh, total here you can start your formula by equal or by, by plus equal sum or plus sum equal sum into you want to add these subjects from one here to here you can look at that formula here you are looking the formula c3 to g3 it means that you want to add these values these values look at here from here to here so you find out here this is the 342 is uh, your total marks of that all subjects okay and now I want to put the formula of average here as I have told you about that uh, we are creating we are making the sheet result sheet of those students who are gaining the sub numbers from total marks of each subject is 100 so we can use the formula here plus average a v e r a g e average plus average into and similarly the formula you can find out that's same same formula plus average into c3 to g3 that tell the computer that give me the average of these values look at here this is 64 8 so you can find out here is the formula plus equal sum or here is the formula you can find out here equal or plus average as you have seen that uh, I have started the formula here plus and I have started formula here with equal it's the same that uh, you put the sign of equal uh, you put the sign of plus or you put you don't put the sign of uh, uh, plus so look at here the formula equal it will work here okay so average 
and uh, total you have uh, tell the computer that we have the total of our average look at here if if i if i changed if i change the value over here i'm going to change the value uh, 56 uh, and i'm going to change is 96 and you can you will find out here uh, the total and the average is automatically changing look at here look at here uh, if i'm going to change the subject uh, uh, five marks i'm going to ch change it into 30 uh, 34 you will sign out that 69.8 and totally uh, the uh, decreasing of the total mark but if i am going to tell if i am going to change the value of uh, you can you get his uh, total uh, i'm i'm increasing the subjects marks total marks are automatically increasing and average is automatically increasing it means that when we set the formula in excel it increase it it automatically convert into the formula and as we change the value it automatically change so again you can see here the formula of sum it is the sum formula that uh, equals sum into address to address where you want to add the values and it is the formula of the average and uh, you have to put that spellings equal average into c3 and uh, g3 when you want to get the average of these range look at uh, these range this range get the range of this range so we have we have the range of this value c3 to g3 and you will find out this is the value and this is uh, you can find out uh, here here uh, you can see the start of c and uh, and the end of the g so that was so now we are going to put the formula of uh, grade here and uh, how we can put the formula of grade here it will start the formula with the conditions what what's your average and what will be the grade so where is the average here you can find out here in the i3 you can find out here that is the i and 3 that is this i3 3 row and i column so we will use this cell address for our getting our grade so i'm going to put my formula starting formula equal if okay so it uh, depends on equal if or i'm going to plus if okay plus if if that's the cell address if i3 is greater than and equal to depends on the grades settings i'm g i'm going to I'm, I'm going to put the grade of uh, marks 80 and above than 80 and start average if the student uh, has uh, average uh, more than 80 or equal to 80 so then it means comma and i'm i'm going to put your inverted commas in the inverted commas put the grade of a plus and we going place a plus so i have completed this uh, conditions that uh, oh, some student may any student if he or she get the marks uh, of average marks more than 80 and equal to 80 and they will get uh, the a plus grade comma and then now uh, we are going to exceed uh, the conditions here the comma and other conditions is going to solve here that com so and if you say if plus if 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 the average greater than and equal to 70 so the greater may be should be depends on you that what grade you want and what conditions uh, you may change these numbers 80 85 90 depends on the requirement of uh, that institutions that what kind of uh, what they are required to put the grade of there i'm just uh, giving you that examples okay you can change you can change your formula according to your uh, systems according to your situations according to your requirements so here i'm going to put uh, the grade of uh, a grade so you can find out it is it is, it is too easy to simple that uh, if gra if average uh, is uh, greater than and equal to 80 it means that uh, you, are, uh, you know about uh, this i3 is the cell address of your average if someone get the marks of average greater than or equal to 80 then computer will give a plus grade 
and now if if this and computer will give you and uh, this one so you know about it what's going on so this is the formula we are going to tell about you okay okay plus if if into this is the average if average okay greater than and equal to 60 and we are going to tell about computer gave it to the B grade and comma plus F with average greater than and equal to greater than and equal to 50 so computer gave it to the C grade and if average greater than and equal to 40 give it to the grade and if average greater than and equal to 33 okay and e grade now we have completed all of our conditions that uh, if 33 and uh, greater than equal to 33 but else if student get uh, else marks of 33 to 100 uh, more than 100 or 30 lower uh, less less than uh, 33 then it is fail so now you had to you have to close the parenthesis I have uh, recommended you that uh, don't uh, count your parenthesis that how much parenthesis you have to close just press enter here just press enter here and av as you will press enter you will find out uh, a message is here and click on the yes and it will automatically put your parenthesis here you will find out here let look at look at here the all parenthesis are closed and we have a formula here look at here we have a formula here and now you will find out the a grade of uh, 78 because you can find out the conditions here where, where is the a grade look at here the a grade here is here is and uh, here we have uh, some mistakes in the formula i'm going to tell you about what's the grade and uh, it was uh, it was the grade here a plus okay so in what is commas so it is the plus so you know about uh, what's what's the problem that you know about uh, what's the grade is here a grade and how computer is giving us uh, this a grade uh, now we have to tell you about then look at that look at that condition here look at this condition so I'm going to zoom into conditions look at this conditions that if the average greater than equal to 70 then gave it to the a grade so you can see here our marks are 78 it's more than 70 and lower to the 80 so it is the putting the computer is putting us the a, a grade if i change the value of the subjects number of subjects suppose I'm changed the value look at here now average is 83 it's mean that 80 and more than 80 and it's automatically changed the grading formula a plus I'm not going to change the value I'm going to change look at 20 look at look at look at look at here I'm going to change no no now this is the average is 60 and lower than 70 then uh, you can find out the grade is B uh, similarly we can put the formula of remarks with the help of grades so or we can we can we can also put the formula of remarks with average too depends on what condition you are using both conditions i may i can use as i was using the grade here a plus i can i can give here most excellent and others depends on here we i can change and I'm going to change the value. I'm going to, I'm going to put this formula with the help of grade. In this situation, you will find out that how we can use 
both the numeric value and the alphabetic values in the formulas. I will tell you about the difference between after completing by this formula. Keep your mind, keep your focus with this formula, keep your all intentions with this formula because it is too much necessary that you should hear and watch completely. And I am going to tell you about again that uh, you are watching this video with uh, my channel from my channel Lunar Computer College. If you did not subscribe this channel, subscribe it because uh, it is an international channel where the, all of the students from the all over the world can learn computer educations and you can get uh, more videos here all of the stuffs like uh, uh, educational videos entertainment videos you can find out here so please remarks and uh, like and share videos too and tell other persons to give and share this videos that other person can also get the knowledge from my channel so I'm going to tell you about the formula of remarks now. The formula will start with plus if, okay, if, if J3. J3 is the cell address of your grade. If J3 is equal to A plus. So you have, you will find out uh, after completing the formula, I will tell you about uh, what was the difference between the grade formula and the remarks formula because we have put the formula of the grade with the help of the average and now we are putting the for remark formula with the, with the help of the grade. Grade value is uh, non-numeric value, you know A, A, B, C, D, A plus and then non-numeric value is the alphabetic value and uh, a non-numeric value. So we will not uh, put here the grade greater or lesser, so we will only put here the equal j3 is equal to a plus then put the comma after then and now we are going to mention the remarks here so i'm going to uh, give the remarks of the most excellent so it is the formula of the most excellent here and similarly you can change you can edit the formula and you can give the more remarks about I'm, go I'm going to tell you about uh, if uh, recognition next condition is uh, comma plus if the grade is equal to a then excellent if you can you can ch you can watch you can see that uh, comma is going to give the remarks and comma is going to change next value if if comma comma plus if if the grade is equal to b so if the grade is equal to b the remarks is very good if the grade is equal to C and remarks is uh, good if the grade is equal to D so remarks is fair you can change these remarks according to your own requirements it's not necessary it's not compulsory that you will use these remarks these are just uh, examples everything is just examples you can change everything depends on the conditions okay and uh, if the grade is equal to e so uh, bad uh, poor conditions uh, you have a poor conditions poor conditions and if the students have the great the greater acceptor uh, of uh, a plus to e so they are in the conditions of that they are the fail they are failure students 
and uh, depends on what uh, statement uh, what uh, remarks uh, you are putting here on the failure uh, I'm going to change a uh, black sheep black sheep okay and uh, enter and Y press and you can find out here in the B grade and you have the remarks of very good so I'm going to tell you about uh, now double click here okay here 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 and align your cell look at here here and here here too here and merge faster your headings here merge here look at here merge and center now you can see, find out here your this two any name numbers any name numbers any name and numbers so I'm going to put your uh, more name here I just uh, this uh, th these are all the examples of uh, the result sheet <coughs> so select these two and double click here and now it's very simple to make a result sheet uh, first only you have to put a first uh, formulas and you don't uh, have to put uh, the formula again and again just uh, select this these for all formulas and uh, put mouse here and uh, make this uh, get this shape of the mouse and double click here you will find out that computer has completely converted all these values and it automatically sums and grade and remarks you have so hope you have uh, understood that how we can use how can we how we can make this result sheet and uh, now uh, it's uh, other things that how to how to decorate this sheets uh, but you may decorate this sheet according to your requirements according to your readings but uh, today I was just I want to tell you about uh, or how you should use the formulas of uh, making the sheet if anything you want to know if anything uh, if you want more or others any questions you have in your mind so feel free to ask me in the comments okay and uh, I will try it uh, I will try my best to tell you about to give you about the I will uh, about uh, the your requirements so at the end I will tell you about I will ask you to subscribe my channel and uh, okay we are going to close this video bye bye